the holidays are here. How was that? Yeah, <laughs> blew out the sound a little bit. It's not on me if you're not ready for my festive cheer. Hello and welcome back to the Adore Beauty YouTube channel. My name's Amy. I'm the senior editor here at Adore Beauty. And if you can't tell by my festive get up, we are talking about holiday gifting. What the heck? to buy that person that you just have no bloody idea. If you are struggling with holiday gifting this year, I'm gonna help you out by basically giving you a beauty editor's edit, cut of our holiday gifting category, depending on who you wanna buy for. We're gonna play a bit of a game. I'm gonna pull out of this stocking a person and then I'm gonna match that person with the perfect gift. So my videographer has very kindly written out some people that I'm sure you have in your life that you might need a gift for, like your colleague or, I actually don't know. I don't know what any of these are in here. Number one, co-worker you don't know well. Oh, a classic. You wanna go for something that is gonna be like universally beloved. A go-to option I would say for anyone that you don't know that well or just Kris Kringle co-worker gifts in general, Candles, like one of the beautiful glass house, like the big Taha candle, or you could do a candle gift set. We've got some really good candles gift sets, like with the little minis, so the glass house candles gift sets, Joe Loves, Circa, so many options, but can't go wrong with a candle. And if they don't like it, well, that's their problem, that's not your problem. All right, next up. Gardening enthusiast. Okay, so everyone else is gonna get this person like some gloves or a shovel, trowel thing or a seed, but you are gonna get them the Aesop exfoliating hand wash because if your friend or your loved one is a gardener, their hands are probably a little bit worse for wear. I was gonna say it's SPF. Well, also actually SPF would be a great gift because they're spending a lot of time outside. So maybe the ultraviolet, you could get them one of their really cute gift sets or just the regular full size of their favorite ultraviolet sunscreen. I feel like Santa. Oh, another classic at the holidays. The don't buy me anything friend. You know the one. Oh, I don't need anything. Just your company's gift enough. Do not fall for this trap. Uh -huh. Usually we would get food. Candles is also a good option for the don't get me anything friend. If they're like a close friend of yours, I would get either a mini skincare starter set from a brand like Laneige, Alpha H, any of those brands that are doing a fun gift set. Actually, if you really want to make the don't get me anything friend feel bad, well, not feel bad to be like, no, you are that important to me that I did obviously get you something. You could get them a Maison Balzac, the incense, the the, bur the oil burner, or the glass carafes, because they are just so beautiful and it's just like, kind of like a whatever, like don't get me anything friend. Don't be the don't get me anything friend. All right, next we have... Uncle Ben. So Uncle Ben is a an uncle or a semi-distant relative that you quite like and you like catching up with them in the holidays. Kind of like maybe like a, a more like a bougie men's skincare or bougie men's grooming kit or product. Something like the Bad Norwegian moisturizer or they do a shave cream. Burley do a really good beard balm, a universal face oil, something like that. Like not a subtle hint, but just like a, you're worth it. Ooh, your friend that buys every new iPhone as soon as it comes out. So this is a person in your life that is cutting edge. They like newness. What about um, like one of our limited edition hair packs, like the Cloud9 straightener limited edition pack, or a GHD limited edition. The Glass House Christmas candles, you can only buy them at Christmas time. So that might be a nice kind of thoughtful little nod there to their, to their newness and ingenuity. Can you tell I'm just really making a lot of this up as we go? Mum! Okay, mum deserves a good treat. All the kids could pull their money together and dad can chuck in a bit too. And we can get mum the limited edition 
Dyson Supersonic or the Air Wrap in the beautiful holiday limited edition colors. We could get mum a discovery set, the Who is Elijah fragrance sets, the Juliet Has a Gun fragrance gift set, or we could get mum a Kerastase hair pack because the products are such high quality and it already comes in festively wrapped packaging. Mm. Distant cousin, ugh, oh, can't be bothered. Yeah, They're getting the gift of your company. Oh, your boss. I wanna say for your boss, I mean, depends how close you are with them. If you have a really nice working relationship with your boss, you could get them a fragrance diffuser. So maybe the Circa Amber and Sandalwood is really beautiful. If your boss, you just wanna get them something small, I would get them um, like a bauble or a, you know, one of the kind of like limited edition Christmas decorations like um, Glass House and Circa have their little ball ball tins or even the Lanolips 101 ointment decoration. Not too expensive, but crowd pleasers. Next one is Dad. Or we could also sub that in for fatherly figure, grandparent, um, but a male figure in your life that's a loved one. I think let's get them the Adore Beauty. It's this, I believe it's the seven piece men's pack that's like skin, hair, body wash, the whole deal, and a toiletries bag. So there's literally no excuse to not have some kind of self-care grooming routine. What about like a Giorgio Armani Aqua Di Gio gift set, YSL, Tommy Hilfiger? <sighs> Am I getting paid by the hour for this or what's the go? Your artistic friend or a loved one in your life that really appreciates like the small details, like some nice packaging, either a makeup brush set. So Spectrum brushes have their amazing makeup brush sets that are also quite affordable. Or another option purely because, I mean, the products are great, but also the packaging is so beautiful and considered is the 11 hair packs. There's a few different ones and they all feature some commissioned artwork from an indigenous artist. We have the beauty lover. For the beauty lover in your life, it has to be a bougie makeup set. For example, Benefit, they have an advent calendar, the more the merrier. Even like an Anastasia Beverly Hills, one of their palettes, like the Renaissance palettes. MAC also do some really great limited edition festive sets, but also just generally speaking, their artistry palettes. I mean, I don't know what your budget is, but there's a Longcom advent calendar, 250 bucks with a whole lot of goodies there. And actually a good gift for everyone, speaking of advent calendars, is the Adore Beauty advent calendar. It's 12 days of Christmas, 99 bucks. I know that's kind of now we're going back to gifts that I would like to receive. I would actually like to receive any and all of these just for anyone that might need to know. And that wraps up our festive gift guide for people you don't know what to buy for. Thank you for joining us. To any um, person that we've missed, just don't get them anything. It's fine. Or a voucher. An Adore Beauty voucher. That's also an excellent option. Okay. I need to just put my gifting superpowers to bed because the video needs to end. If you have any excellent gift ideas that I've missed, please do pop them in the comments here. And have a wonderful holiday period. See you next time.